So I don't know, I guess I haven't talked to you guys very much about my buddy Gunner here. Uh, I took Gunner in. Gosh, I'm trying to think. I don't know if it's been two months yet. Yeah, it has. Um, I think it's been a little bit over two months. I've had Gunner. And uh, anyway, so I got, uh, you know, when I took him in, I got him all cleaned up. And actually, the day I got him, he looked kind of like this. He was all, his white hair was all brown. He, I think he must have lived outside. So he had infections in both ears. So very bad infections, actually, they said. It was two different kinds. Uh, yeast and then whatever else I don't know you know I bacterial I assume I don't know in any case but he had two different kinds of infections and uh, so anyway so we got him all fixed up there and then last month we got him neutered the poor guy I uh, I don't know I felt pretty bad about that for a little while to tell you the truth but uh, yeah, ultimately, he doesn't seem to care, so he hasn't changed him in the slightest. So if he doesn't care, I guess that's all that counts. He's still, uh, still basically the same dog. So he, uh, I don't know, I don't think he took many rides uh, before, uh, <coughs> sorry, the dust, uh, dust gets to me. I don't think he took very many rides with his previous owner or owners um, since I got him, though. He, uh, I can't go outside with him without him looking up to the truck to, uh, to see if we're going to go on another, another ride somewhere. So the UTV, uh, when I first put him in this, he wasn't quite sure what to think, but as you folks can see, he, uh, he has become acclimated to it, so he... <laughs> He definitely loves to go on rides. I feel kind of bad. I wish I could take him every day. All day, every day. He would love that. Anyway, my question, though, for you guys out there that that do take your dogs on rides, um, have you bought those goggles for your dogs to protect their eyes? It's something that uh, I tried to put human goggles on him, but I honestly don't think that they block all that much sand from from getting to his eyes. So I would be curious to know what you guys out there that uh, take your pooches with you, uh, if you, if you uh, do, like I say, <coughs> if you do put goggles on your dogs or if you have those, those dog goggles or what it is that you do, or if I'm being completely ridiculous and you really don't need uh, 
goggles on your dog at all, that their eyes work perfect in these kind of conditions, I, I don't know. I'm not a vet, so uh, I don't really know much about, about this sort of thing. So we're going to stop and take a break right here, uh, and I'll show you guys uh, this little crick here. Right, Gunner? <laughs>